Hello, Tom here from King's Auto Repair, and today I want to show you how to make a mouse repellent system to keep under the hood of your car. We see a lot of wire damage done by mice in the fall and winter time because the mice are looking for a nice warm place to make their house for the winter. And you get home with your nice warm car, you park it, and the mouse comes and he says, oh, this looks great, and he climbs in there, and he starts sniffing around and he smells how good the wiring smells in your car. And that's because the conduit that the wiring is in is made out of a lot of natural products. Auto manufacturers have switched to using renewable products in the last couple of years. And one of the things that they, they have moved to is a conduit for the wiring that's actually made of a soy product. So they actually take soybeans and turn this into plastic. And the mouse gets in there and he smells those soybeans. So he goes and eats the wiring in your car. So this is a quick, easy way that we can go and help repel mice out of the car and keep them from chewing the wiring. For this project, we're gonna need a couple things. We're going to need some cotton balls, we're going to need a pill bottle. It doesn't have to be a medicine one, like doesn't have to be a medicine one like this. You can use an aspirin one, what, whatever, whatever you have. Something with a screw cap. You're going to want peppermint oil. Costs a couple dollars at the store. A couple cotton balls, a piece of string or old shoelace, and you're going to need something to put holes in this pill bottle. Uh, what you don't want to use is you don't want to use rubber bands and we'll get to that later on when we talk about securing this underneath the hood. So what you want to do is you want to take your pill bottle, leave the cap on, and you want to put holes in it. So you see this one already comes with holes in it because I recorded this once before and uh, didn't hit the record button. So what we want to do is we want to put two holes up near the top, near the cap. So we're going to take our tool either a knife or a scissors or something that we can just kind of lightly push through the plastic. Um, I'm using a little can opener on a multi-tool. Uh, you can use a drill bit and just slowly drill through. Um, and I'd almost be willing to bet a Phillips screwdriver might work for this too. So, but what you're gonna do is you're gonna take it, you're gonna put a hole up near the top here, and then you're gonna turn it over 180 degrees at the other hole you just made on the bottom and you're going to put another hole through the top. And then you're going to put some random holes in the sides here and in the bottom. So we'll go and add some more holes here in the sides because we want this to get out and the smell to basically permeate the engine compartment. So we're gonna put a couple more holes in it here and watch this is the most dangerous part because we're putting holes in things with sharp objects so we're going to put some holes in and then we're going to put some cotton balls in uh, so take some cotton balls and we'll drop them down there and what we're going to do is take our take our peppermint extract here and we're going to turn it over upside down in here and we're going to put some peppermint extract in it. Cotton balls will soak it up. We're going to set that there for the moment. Cap our peppermint oil. We're going to take our string and we're going to pass it through the top two holes we made. And after we have it through there, we're going to cap it up and we're going to go find a place to put this in the engine compartment. What we want to do is we want to take our pill bottle with our shoestring in it and we want to find a place to put this on the car that it's not going to be a fire hazard or get caught in anything. But we also want to make sure we put it in a place where the mice go and chew the wiring. So let's come in here and take a closer look. So what we want to do is we actually want to look around in the engine compartment here and if we can, we want to keep it away from anything that has to do with the belt or moving pulleys up here. We also want to keep it away from the exhaust, which will be down on the side on a rear wheel drive vehicle, or you might see the exhaust manifold up in the front here if it were a front wheel drive vehicle. 
places that we're looking to put this, it's gonna be around the intake area. A lot of times there's wiring that runs under this intake area. And what you're gonna to wanna to do is take your pill bottle and on this car, we're gonna attach it to right down in here. We're gonna just attach it on top of these cables here. So we'll just take it and tie it on so it doesn't go anywhere, but it still gets hot from driving it around. And we'll put a knot in it. That way we have a knot in it. We can take it back off later and recharge it again with more peppermint oil later on. So just cut these guys off then when you're done and leave it long enough that you can tie this back on. And that's all you need to do. So, and that'll be good. Check that once a month, top it off a little bit of peppermint oil. It'll keep your mouse, the mouse, the mice, mice. I can speak today. It'll keep the mice at bay. So thank you. Have a great day.